Hello there, everyone. The Andrade here. And welcome back to episode 61 of our All the Mod 6 to the Sky Let's Play series. Uh, where today we are continuing on our unbelievable journey of getting all of the bees that we need for our uh, wither thingy my duty here. Wither compass. Yeah. Ultimate goal here is to get the wither bee. Yes. Yes. Anyway, in between episodes, I went ahead and crafted the lava reagents so that we could, uh, you know, make the get the bee so we can get our lava bee, breed it with our cob bee and then get a stoned bee and pray that it works. Uh, it's 100 percent chance. It's 100 percent chance that there's a 60 percent chance. <laughs> 60 percent of the time it works 100 percent of the time. Right. Is that is that what I'm getting at here? Like, I, I, I don't understand what that means. Uh, anyway whatever uh let's go ahead and pop into this compact machine because it's small so it'll be easy to you know hit the bees with the stuff that i need i didn't want to have to chase them around in a giant one so if we take our bees and we spawn them boop and boop they're going to be all happy flying around saying hi howdy doody what we want to do is get the bee and feed him the lava reagents okay now he's all lovey-dovey we're going to feed you the compressed cobble, if I didn't place it quickly enough. Uh, where are you at? Get over here. Ah, there you go. Now create me a new bee. Yes, we got a stoned bee. All right, pick up you. Oh, you can't even pick them. Oh, my goodness. Okay, well... That is unfortunate. Um, what do we do about this situation? Well, first off, let's go ahead and I expected them to not be able to be duplicated, but I thought you'd be able to capture them at least. Um, so I have a stone to be, but I need to let it grow. All right, well, let's get out of here, leave them there. They're safe and we need to figure out some other way to capture these guys so I can uh, move them around. That is very annoying. Um, mob capture. Doesn't cyclic have like pokeballs? Literally, that's what they are. They look like pokeballs. Yeah, monster balls. Um, uh, but you need coral to make this. Okay. Um, hmm. Water and dead coral, but I don't have any dead coral. Seawater and coral seeds. Seawater. I do have coral seeds, don't I? Yeah. Orange coral seed. And didn't I have a seawater? How did I make this? Let's get a, uh, what is that, a barrel? Uh, I'm having to remember all this beginning of the stuff pack, or beginning of pack stuff. Let's go ahead and reset this so it stops telling me about stuff. And we can actually just put it away. On our major spell book can go away. That can go away. We don't need to sleep. Astral Tome can go away. Cool. Okay. So you get the seawater and we do that. And that made us coral. Okay. How did we make seawater again, though? Um, isn't it water and sand? Water and sand? Is this an accurate assessment? Yeah, because it's witch water and sand makes soul sand. I think this makes seawater. Yes. Okay, cool. Uh, and what we can do is, you know, the good old tick accelerate. Uh, so let's go ahead and put the water in first. Boop, 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 boop. We have so much time, it's not even a big concern. And you, 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 bam. Okay, cool. That gave us five coral. I think that is enough. Let's try these monster capture balls uh, and snowballs. Are you kidding me? Don't I have like, I don't have any snow. All this, and I don't even know if it's going to work. Um, monster capture ball. Soul snare. Huh, okay, I need snow. Do I have frozen cores? No. 
That is a snowball duplicating. Okay. Snow blocks. A blast chiller with a ball cast. It looks like that's the way I'm going to have to go. All right. Let's get a blast chiller. Let's get a ball cast. Blast chiller. All this. Just so I can see if this even works. Because now my bees are trapped in that area. Um, Invar. Let's go ahead and just grab a stack of that. Okay, and you. Bam, there's a blast chiller. We needed this ball cast, which requires bronze plates, which is easy enough. Do I have bronze available? No, figures. How do we make bronze? System you need to learn. Um, induction smelter or... Mm, yeah, okay. Tin and copper. All right. All right. All right. All right. Uh, blast chiller can stay. Go in there. Go there. You go back to your slot. Okay, cool. All right. Um, bronze. It's you. And you. Let's wait for two ingots to show up. But the right two ingots. Bam. Yes, yes. Okay. You're going to go in the induction smelter and make me bronze and never ask me again for bronze. Okay, cool. Um, so then we need our hammer and we need our bronze. Give me some bronze plates. Go away, go away. You, you, you. Exporter. Um, what other usages do you have other than these weird things? Ah, you can turn honey into honey blocks. Cobalt. Yeah, you can make regular ingots. I don't care about that, though, from liquid ingots. It's just. Yeah, literally, you're going to be made. You're going to be used just to make snow. It looks like. All right. Well, that's OK. Um. We don't need that. I need an importer. And a crafter. Make me snow blocks. Have them on craft. Or I could just make tons of snow blocks real quick and not have to worry about it. Whatever. Whatever. I'm already here. I'm already here and I'm already doing the thing. All right. Uh, thermal expansion. Next to this dude, because he's already got power here. Um, let's grab a power cable. So you are now going to be our fluid encapsulator. That's fine. It's fluids. Blast chiller deals with fluids too, right? Right. Crafter can go here and the importer can go here. You are going to be Output to the back, input from the top. Uh, I gotta give that thing a smack so that it can pull the power out. And we gotta smack it from this side. Smack, smack, there we go. Fill up on your power, cool. Okay, now um, I should have gave it a recipe. Or I should have made the recipe for snowballs while I was up here, but that's okay. Snowball recipe is you um, without you. No, get out of here. Get out of here. Thermal expansion, let's go put the cast in here. Cast can always stay in here because that's all this machine's gonna do. And now we're gonna say, hey, give me some snowballs, a stack of them. Sweet. I don't even know if I wanna speed upgrade this thing because I don't think, I mean, we're not gonna be making snowballs that often. Um, but now that gives us the ability to make these monster balls. And let's see if they can capture bees. Let's pray that they do.
because otherwise I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, where did my B thing go over here? Okay. Oh, it scared me. Okay. It looks like it does. Lava B, Cobb B. Okay. You need to hurry up and grow. How much time you got left? Um, that requires more coral, though, for these things, doesn't it? All right, well, how can we automate coral? Coral essence. Probably should have used the coral that we had for the coral essence. Yeah, this is the only way for us to capture things. This is what we're going to do. Uh, we need one. We need four of each coral, it looks like. That may be an issue because I just used all my horn coral. Great. Great, great, great. Otherwise, we would have had almost enough. Um, hmm. Brain, fire, tube, horn. Well, I don't have enough tube coral either. So basically what this is telling me is I need to go and um, set up that waterlog sieve again so that we can do the sand thing. But at least this way we have the bees captured so that we can uh, use them later. Slightly annoying that it doesn't work in the mob imprisonment tool. I understand that they don't want me to duplicate them, but just these little things like this that are just, uh, you know, slightly annoying when it comes to mod packs. I mean, I could have I could capture them in bee jars, I guess. I forgot those existed. I did forget bee jars are a thing. Yeah, I don't need to have them in these. Well, that was a re recipe in futileness there. Well, we learned something new, right? You learned how to make monster capsules if a mob imprisonment tool doesn't work. But we could just do this. Forgot about that. Yeah. Okay. Well, I feel slightly dingus, but not as dingus as I felt in the past with other things. Okay. All right. Uh, morphing tool, go ahead and reset yourself. Go away. All right, so that is the stoned bee. So we have that guy now. These two are extraneous. We don't really need them at the moment. Um, so we got the cob bee. We got the cob bee. And so the stone bee now needs to mix with the quartz bee to make a gold bee. So let's go ahead and work on the quartz bee. That is compressed blocks of quartz. And I do not want to craft those by hand. So let's go ahead and teach the system how to do that. Compressed block of quartz is this, which is this. There's going to be a lot of quartz here, by the way, which is this. And I have blocks of quartz. Okay. So I need a total of nine of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them. Um, 3x, I need eight. 648 compressed blocks man i don't even know how much is that going to use why does it feel like that that's not even going down why do i feel like that like didn't even use any of our quartz i don't know what happened there that was weird um dragon scale May have to kill the dragon again before all is said and done here, because these bees are driving me nuts. And I probably want to, you know, breed the bees and duplicate them so I, I have a spare of each bee, too, at some point. Didn't those particle effects look different before? Uh, anyway, okay, so we got a quartz bee and a stoned bee, and that's going to get us our gold bee. So we need to feed it... Um, Special quartz, just quartz, five blocks of quartz, and then five specifically industrial hemp fiber, which figures I don't have, but we can just easily swap that into our garden cloche. We have plenty of seeds now. Um, storage and automations, that's you instead of those seeds. 
give me that, do that. And tick accelerate you a little bit because I need a bunch. Okay, well, we got one hemp fiber. Um, so how many do I need for this? I need five industrial hemp fiber. So we're getting there. And then for the for this, I just need five blocks of quartz. I also need the stone bee to uh, grow because he is still a baby bee. Uh, hemp. Okay, well, we have all that we need for that. So let's go ahead and go to our bee spawner. Or our bee breeding area, really. And if I were to set up an apiary, I could do the bee breeding automatically in the apiary, but that would require us to really tear up into the bees, uh, which I don't really know if we can do right now. Not really. All right, buddy, I need you to grow. Like, you still have 560 seconds. And... Let me guess, you grow my eating industrial hemp fiber. Is this assessment correct? Yes. If you could stop flying around, I could feed you and speed up. Can you like just eat string? Like what if I just gave you string? It wants industrial hemp fiber because it's a stoned bee. It wants hemp. Get it? Get it? All right, we'll come back when this bee's grown because there's not really much we can do until that happens. Okay, I uh, tick accelerated myself to a bunch more hemp, which allowed me to speed this bee up because I didn't feel like waiting five minutes for it to grow. So yeah, anyway, uh, so we have our stoned bee, bam, and our quartz bee. So let's go ahead and feed this dude his quartz that he wants. He likes the quartz. Let's give this guy some of his hemp. All right, find each other, mate, make friends. Are you telling me that failed? It did. Bruh. What's our percent chance on this? A 20% chance that there's a 60% chance. Okay. I really don't know what that means. Uh, let's try this again. One out of five times this is going to fail. That's lovely. Uh, uh, Quartz B, where are you? And there's probably a cooldown and how fast these guys can do this. So, yep, look, I can't do it again. Oh, my goodness. Friends, just, just, just do what I want you to do, okay? Like, just do it. B breeder. Brown mushroom nest. Arcane brick. You may craft this into gems. Oh, okay. Um, Ant resourceful breeder. Yeah, it's in an apiary. You can't use this outside of an apiary. Lovely. It'd be nice to just have these guys sit there and then do the thing. But in order to create an apiary, we need a... Excuse me? Are you going to search? Oh, because those are all saying they are valid apiary blocks. A uh, tier one apiary requires tier four beehives and a bunch of honeycombs. We have not, we have bees, but we haven't started breeding them at all yet. So, or not breeding, but we haven't started producing any resources because, well, we don't need to. So, all right, buddy. First off, why are you so low health? I think because you got, when you grew, you grew right next to the wall. Um, What's your cooldown period? Obviously longer than I would like you to be. Uh, where's the other bee? It's scaring me when they like disappear. And I have to wait each time and it's not even going to be guaranteed chance that this is going to work. Ugh. And that just gets us to the gold bee, which then allows us to mutate to a netherite bee. But there's got to be honey. It's going to have flour, which means we're going to put them in the beehive and then put the blocks into the right down, and that'll get us that. That part is easy. It's just this part. I just got to get this one gold bee. Okay. 
maybe if I like, you know, leave, maybe if we sleep, maybe, you know, pass some time in game, maybe that helps. I do not have good RNG, so my concern is that it's going to fail again. All right, are you kidding me? Create brittle, no moving, solid wall, like... Tell me when you're able to be bred again. That's what I want. Come on, my friends. All right, well, we'll just let that sit for a minute. Let's work towards uh, something else. What? I don't know, but something else. Um, so that was the stoned bee. We got that. We got that. We're working on the quartz bee. We're doing that. Okay, spooky bee. Do we have the bones yet? No. Figures. We wouldn't. It's going to take us a while to get those, isn't it? All right, let's go the other path. So that was for the netherite bee. Now we need to work towards getting the withered bee. Withered bee comes from a coal bee and a spooky bee. We've already determined we cannot get the spooky bee yet, so we'll work on the coal bee. Coal bee comes from a lumber bee and a blazing bee. The lumber bee is a egg. So let's get the lumber bee egg. And I don't. I want actually that and then that. And the blazing bee comes from, again, a spooky bee and a magma bee. And the magma bee is a egg too. Right? Right. And it requires some magma from cyclic and some magma cream from... What mod is this? Thermal series. Uh, this we can teach. That shouldn't be too bad, right? Is that assessment correct? This shouldn't be bad. This shouldn't be bad. It's going to be bad. Um, we need to melt magma cream to make magma cream or magma blocks. Huh. <laughs> I'm going to assume one block makes a bucket. Yes, one block is one bucket. So we need four blocks, which means I have to set up my Tinker Smeltery again. Because I tore it apart because I'm like, eh, we're not going to need that for a while. And I was cleaning up this area, making it look nice. Okay, well, Tinkers it is. All right. We need to do it. We don't have a choice. Uh, that's you. We need our regular lava is fine. Our controller. Do we need seared glass? Sure. We need our spouts or drains. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So let's go ahead and set this up. Um, and I'm, I'm pretty sure this is where it used to be. You go away. Give me my dank set to cobblestone or dirt or something else. Nope. Okay. Uh, so you're going to be bricks, 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 brick, brick, and then drain casting table faucet okay and then lava tank controller and then a piece of glass in the middle just because we like it to look be able to see inside valid valid give me all the dirt back okay uh so we needed magma blocks right so let's grab that, and then we need four of these. So go ahead and melt that, okay? And then we need buckets. And then as soon as that's melted, we should be good to go. And that gets us these buckets, and then we're gonna need to get uh, the magma cream bucket Wait, that's what I'm already doing. We need to get the cyclic stuff. Magma buckets. That one is easy. Okay, that can go... Well, is it though? 
We'll deal with that in a second. Okay, give me that bucket. Three and four. Okay. So that's those. Um, I'll leave this up for the moment and see, but let's go to storage and automation. So we have the melting chamber. Yeah, the melting chamber. I'm going to have to pipe the melting chamber into... The solidification chamber. How did I end up with five buckets of this? I swear I only put four down. Um, yeah, this magma is going to have to go. Can you bucket out of this? Oh, and I don't want to break this. How, how about we make another melting chamber? What do you cost? Nothing. Let's make another melting chamber and let's just come out of here. Um, melting chamber. Like if I were to just bucket straight out of you, is that is that possible? I don't know. Can I put magma in you? Okay, and then I get a bucket. That's a negative. Okay, so we do need a fluid encapsulation chamber, or encapsulator again. I don't want to, like, I don't need to automate this because it's not like, I mean, we're only using it for this recipe and then that's pretty much the only time we're going to use this. So we're going to put this here. I need to get a pipe. You're going to be able to input from the right. Um, morphing tool you there and then energy, I guess, not ideal. Uh, morphing tool again. Okay, so you got power, you got magma. If we put buckets in here, you're going to fill up. Okay. So that was one, two, three, four. Two, three, Got it. Slightly annoying, but easy enough. And then we can just, you know, break that, that, that. Then all of that can go away. Except for you, sir. And you go back where you belong. You go away, you go away. You go away. I don't think we need this tinker set up, but we'll just leave it there for now. Um, let's go back and try and breed those bees real quick. Actually, let's, uh, let's go make this gold or this other bee. And maybe we can breed two sets of bees at once. Um, so we need a dragon scale. Out of order, but whatever. Uh, oh. You went away. Oh, no. Okay, good. Whew. Okay. Give me this magma bee, please. Thank you. Okay. Behave for Mama Magma. All right, let's go back over here and try and breed those two bees together. See if they are going to, you know, comply. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? 
Where where'd my bees go, folks? Where are they? They're gone. How what the heck happened? Where did the bees go? The court this is why I wanted to be able to put them into mob duplicators so stuff like this didn't happen. The bees are gone. This is extremely frustrating. Urgh. I do not think that that was a good decision to stop you from being able to put the bees into the mob duplicator. That's all I'm saying. All right, that's it for this episode. We'll figure out what we're doing next episode. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe. I do appreciate it. It really does help out the channel. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.